kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bight Stadium with its tent light structure. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Tunisia versus France. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And here's how Tunisia will line up. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre-forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. You, Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Karim Benzema. And they kick off here. Sliti. Could play it in. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Will France be a hit or a miss? What do I mean by that? Well, when they won in 1998, everything was rosy in the camp, but they were dumped out in the group stage in 2002. They were runners-up in 2006, and then they completely imploded in South Africa in 2010. How about this time as holders? Well, they've got some great players. They've got an experienced coach. I think they've got good team spirit, so I think they're better prepared this time. I think they've got every chance, first of all, getting through this group, but also going on and winning the tournament. And players waiting in the centre. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. He must finish! There it is! A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, here it is again. And how many times have we seen this in recent games? Teams trying to play out from the back not doing it particularly well, giving away sloppy possession and then getting punished. It's a really poor goal to concede. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Pavard. Benzema. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Rabiel. Shot blocked, but still alive. Able to deal with the threat.
Good move in the making from France. Mbappe. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Jaziri. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Pavard. Not a great pass. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. challenge that was required Sleety on to Benzema Mbappe well that's how to keep the opposition at bay Jaziri And Pavar on the ball. And he's through here. Able defending, but can they keep it out? Laiduni. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Crossing opportunity. Can he take advantage? Crossing him. Body in the way again. He's got to score! Oh, that's a fine save. Oh dear, not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range, he should be scoring, and he knows it. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. Will it be the leveler? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. is sounded for half-time in this game. Not on top of his game for once, Karim Benzema. I think it's fair to say that, Stuart. Well, he's such a clever player in and around the box, but he just hasn't received it enough in those sort of areas. He's got to work harder to find space for himself, that's for sure. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. He must finish! There it is! A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. And will it be the leveller? And a goal to level this contest! And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. He has time to play it over. Very quick thinking there. Saifedin Jaziri. Sassi. Now with Benzema, 
Perfect challenge. Ball played nicely. There wasn't much in that offside decision. Could have been in business. Griezmann. Mbappé. Now Griezmann. Might take the lead. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. Goal! Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. 14, Adrian Rabio. Sliti. Going well. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And now the delivery. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Now can they make something happen? Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. This looks threatening. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. So the corner played into the box and he's done well to tip it over the bar well they've decided to make a change who can they pick out this looks promising of ground to cover splendid save <laughs> he's driven in the corner not messing around with that clearance Benzema. Now Rabio. Lucas Hernandez. Chance to cross. Benzema. It might be. Terrific piece of anticipation. Griezmann. Kylian Mbappe. Oh, it's in. A two goal cushion now. And the lead fully merited. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and Benzema wasn't going to miss this one. From that sort of range, he was always going to score. That's a well-constructed goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. And 
Benzema. Possibilities inside the box. Might it be Mbappe? Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Matteo Guendouzi. Jules Kunde on the ball. Benzema. Just the challenge that was required. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Jaziri. Ali Malul. Really vital interception here. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, a player who brings a tremendous amount of energy to the pitch, Adrien Rabiot, and we've enjoyed this performance from him, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.